Little black book. You know what time it is. 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 Hey guys and welcome to Little Black Book, baby. Welcome to Christian Dating 101. We're gonna be talking about time wasters. Yes, time wasters. Time wasters. If you're new to the channel, make sure you like, share, subscribe, click on that bell button for the notification of the uploads. And for those of you returnees, you ain't got the middle road. You ain't got. I know it's off. Hold on, let me try again. You ain't got the middle road. You ain't got a bit of road. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that was okay. It was, it was, it was alright, innit? It was alright. Yeah, it put like a six. Alright, cool. Listen, talking to you guys about time wasters. Listen, I'm going to saw a tweet recently um, and it was about the talking stage, right? Listen, let me just be very, very clear and distinct, okay? I'm not even going to describe the talking stage because there's too much definition of how it is. But the talking stage, just keep it simple, you know, the part where you guys are talking. Let me just put this right. <coughs> See how the devil wants to take me out? Because <coughs> these knows I'm about to come for the man then. All right, so in regards to Christian Dating 101 and Time Wasters, Six months, yeah? Six months in a talking stage is a madness. Six months in a talking stage is a madness. Do you understand? Because if you've been going for six months and you could not decide as to whether you're going forward or you're leaving it alone, you've wasted time. You've wasted time. Let me tell you something about men, yeah? When they meet what they need, they say it straight away. They claim it quick. They don't move. They don't waste time. You understand? I'm not going to say what specific time but six months is far too long. Now, if you are talking and you get together and it's within, you know what I mean? And it, it's different. But for talking stage, no, and you see the, the dangerous thing about talking stage is this. There's no definition of what we're doing. A lot of times when guys got you into a talking stage, we're talking for six months. There's no definition of what we are doing. The talking stage means that we are initiated, we've, procrat we've protracted conversation, going towards a certain destination. We've stalled, there's no more money to pay the constructors to build the rest of the building. No, we need to, no, you need to, <laughs> you need to have, you need to sit down with that person and say, listen, what are we doing? Because a lot of guys take advantage of this because they're dragging women along. There's, and there's so many reasons why, we're gonna go into that. But it's, they're, they're dragging women along that, right? Or even a woman as well, women do this too as well. Dragging a person, a male along, right? Just so that they can keep you there because maybe that you're not the building they want to finish. They've got a building elsewhere that they, they've, they've already started up. Um, someone else has given them attention. Someone else is, um, someone else is their main priority. They never were going to give you that time, but they want to just kind of just waste your time. Do you understand? The situationships always happen in the gray area. The gray area is undefined. When you say something's gray, it means it's neither here or neither there. If we're black or white, either we're going to it or we're not going to it. Do you understand? Let me just be very frank. Adam in the Bible, when he saw Eve, said, listen, bottom of my bone, flesh my flesh, let's move on. When Jacob, the son of, um, when, Jake, when even Isaac, when Isaac um, was given Rebecca, he said that he was sad, he mourned the, the death of his mother. As soon as he saw Rebecca, he went into Rebecca and everything was cool. Do you understand? That's a short version. Jacob, when he saw Rachel, he began to weep and cry. Fam, maybe because the walk was long, but he weeped and cried when he saw her. Do you understand? So, even Moses, when he saw the daughter uh, 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 of a Midian, yeah, and he saw Zipporah, fam, it didn't take long. They were married. Do you understand? So, what I'm saying to you is, yeah, that this protracted contract talks that you guys are doing, you're stalling like your, like your, the, the, like the bonus payment and the, the sign up fee ain't correct. Is 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 waste of your time. You know what I'm saying? Listen, men are very very simple. When they want it, they go for it. Listen, any other skew, like I say this all the time. Any other answer apart from yes is always a no. Any other answer from yes is always a no. If you're in protracted conversation for six months, every other answer. That's not yes, it's a no. Do you understand? And look, I can guarantee you this, look, at the end of six months, ask that brother or that sister, look, I want to be with you now or I want to take this to the next level. In fact, even after six months you've been talking, you should take it to the next level. Now, I want to make this very clear. Obviously, to have, I said this in my other video where there's nothing wrong with getting to know somebody, but when you begin the talking stage, it's different from getting to know somebody. The moment you have talking stage, there's been a signal of intent towards somewhere that is going towards a relationship. That's the whole point, it's a talking stage. 
when you're in the when you're in the part of being friends and I'm getting to know you, you can't hold me for nothing. And I can't hold you for nothing. If I decide to get with somebody else, you can't say nothing. You're getting to know me. Do you, do you see what I'm saying? And if somebody says, I'm getting to know you, and they have an expectation behind it, which is that when you're getting to know me, you're gonna be mine, that's talking stage. I'm sorry, you entered the talking stage. That's no longer get to know you. You see, this is why it's so dangerous. This is why it's so dangerous, because then some people spend so much time on talking stage with, with expectations, and the person doesn't even have that intention. Do, do you see it? Stop, like, you're letting, them, you're letting them call you, text you, leaning on you for emotional care, um, and let, you know, they want to see you, they take, they, you take them out, you, they take you out, they, you're, you've become their best buddy. But that's, they don't want you more than best buddy. So now, in the talking stage, we have a thing called P-E-W, okay? P-E-W, pow pow, to the two for the chopper. You know what I'm saying? Okay, that's not it, isn't it? It's pow pow pow, so the two. Anyway, listen, so, um, so P-E-W, Position, expectation, want, yeah? This is to save all the malarkeys that go on in that talking stage, yeah? Position, expectation, want, do you understand? So now, your position is, if you feel like you like this person, ladies and gentlemen, both of you, set parties, if you like the opposite sex, you state, here's my position, yeah? I like you. Here is where it gets techy. Some of you are quiet with your expectation and expecting the person to meet it. That's why you're six months in the talking stage. Because you're not stating your expectation. So the, so the brother or the sister is just running you through. When you're, a sin, when you're a serious candidate and you know what you want, people can't run, people can't run you into the round, you know. People can't drag you along, you know. Trust me, people can't drag you along, you know. So, now, here's the thing. So what happens in expectation, you state what you expect to happen. Listen, my position is I like you. Here's my expectation, I wanna be with you. Do you understand? What's your want? So you ask the person, what's your want? When the person says, ah, uh, you know, I'm just trying to see where it's going, then you say, hey, six months, you, you wanna see where it's going? Tell her, let's go. Look, it's better we be friends. Why are we saying that? It's because then it frees you to do what you need to do. Because a lot of people, a lot of times, people want it in, in talking stage. One party is loyal to the, the only way talking stage can last for six months is when one party is loyal to the to, to, to talking stage and another person isn't. One of you is loyal, one of you isn't. That's why the talking stage has been for six months in protracted, in protracted conversations and trying to find out who's gonna sign the contract. Do you understand? So now, when you state the PEW, yeah, that person now knows where they stand. You now know where you stand. That person says, ah, you know, um, I just wanted to kind of see where we're going. I'm still trying to get to know you. Up six months. And you haven't made me the person you wanna be getting, you haven't made me the person that's exclusive. Listen, you're wasting my time and I'm not about it. Yeah, and I'm not saying it's a hard and fast. I want you to always understand this. Whenever I give you advice, it's never hard and fast. I want you to understand this. It is never hard and fast. There are always what? Exceptions to the rule. The question is whether you are the exception to the rule or not. But my advice is it's just a kind of general ring fence. To save yourself the pain and the ache and the pains. Six months, you're still talking P-E-W. When the person is going on, uh, I'm not really sure, then you say, listen, hey, if you're not sure, that's fine. You go and figure out whether you're sure or not, I'm gonna move on. Do you understand? Yeah? And if that person's serious, he comes and claims you or she comes in and says, look, I want it. But other than that, no other answer apart from yes is always a no. Simple as. Uh, it's not a yes, it's what? A no. You understand? You move on and you continue life. Yeah? Do not get stuck in protracted conversations where it's not going nowhere. Do you understand? Stalling on the works. No. Do you understand? And remember, think before you do. Don't do before you think. Otherwise, you'll be thinking about what you've been doing. You understand? Appreciate you guys. Stay locked, stay loaded. Christian Dating 101. Watch out for Christian Dating 102, baby.